Hi, this is Mato. Welcome to my online chess lecture. In this video I will show you a game between a wood and a Lambert. This game was played in London in 1948. Wood had white pieces and he started with e4. Lambert played e6, d4, d5, the French defense. Knight to c3, d takes on e4, knight takes on e4 black to move. Bishop to d7 was played. An interesting idea intending bishop to c6. Knight to f3. Bishop to c6 attack in the knight. Bishop to d3. Another piece attacks the knight. Knight takes on f6 check. Queen takes on f6. White to move. This is a very interesting moment of the game. Can white play bishop to g5? Developing a piece with a tempo. White can do that. He would be ahead in development. And more. But what if, after bishop to g5, black plays bishop to f3, attacking white queen? So it is fair to say that this is the critical position of the game. What would you do? Bishop to g5 or something else? Please pause and find the best move for white. Wood played bishop to g5 attacking the queen. And where is the queen going? So, Lambert played the only good move and that is bishop takes knight on f3. This same position was reached 18 years later, in a very serious tournament in Russia. That was a game between Kotkov and Akopian, played in Krasnodar, Russia, in 1966. In both games, white continued the same way. What would you do? Please pause and find the best move for white. Did you pause? What did you find? When Wood played bishop to g5, he already knew what to do in this position. And also, in 1966, Kotko knew what to do in this position, because he saw this old game. First, if queen takes on f3, then queen takes queen. Queen takes on g5 is not good because of queen that takes on b7 and white is winning. But after queen takes queen on f3, the game is about equal. Back to our game. So what is the best move for white in this position? What did you find? Wood and also Kotko 18 years later played Queen to d2. Black to move. Queen takes on d4. But this move has a tiny, tiny downside. What is it? White played the move and black designed. Bishop to b5 check. Black queen is lost. This is the end of the game of Wood against Lambert. And also this is how the game between Kotkov and Akopian ended in 1966. What did we learn from this game? It is always better to sacrifice your enemy. Mm, delete this. I meant to say it is always better to learn from other people's mistakes. What do you think of this game? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.